Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polished Corner. Today is a sheet modern video. So I'm really um, excited to bring you this. It's gonna be kind of like a winter theme. She Modern has an awesome collection of foil water decals, which I think are pretty unique. I don't think anybody else has foil water decals out there, not, not that I've seen, so they're pretty fun to work with. She also has um, some new two color ones. So those are pretty cool. I didn't use the two color ones in this video, but I do have an order coming in. So those will be coming up soon. So let's take a look at the picture and then I'll show you how I created it. So let's get started. I'll be using a mood color Yes Sure today, which is my favorite blue. Okay, so when applying um, gel polishes, you just want to apply them in thin coats. So this is my first coat of Yes Sure, and you do want to cure them with an LED light. And Wave Gel cures in my LED for 30, 30 seconds between coats. So I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of the coats on and then cure it and come back. And now I'm going to go ahead and do the second coat. And as you can, as you can tell, it's a little bit um, getting lighter. This is a thermal color change polish. And I love it so much. Both colors are so awesome, especially for winter designs. So I'm going to go ahead and add this to all of my fingers and cure it and come back. All right, so I'm leaving the tacky layer on my um, middle finger and my ring finger. That just helps the, um, the water decals stick a whole lot better. So I'm going to use these cute little beautiful mittens. Remove these foils. I mean, remove remove the protective cover. I just like to trim off the edge here because you can use this as stripes in another design. And I think I'm going to use these little medium sized ones. Awesome thing about this is one of them goes each way. And then I just cut around the design. This is so quick and easy. If you just want to throw some gel polish on your fingers and a cute little nail art design and you are good to go. I'll just cut out the other one and come back. Okay, so here I have them on a little piece of plastic. And what I like to do is just put a drop of water down, slide them into the water. You want to make sure that the back gets wet because um, that's going to, that's what's going to release them from the paper backing. It usually takes just a couple of seconds. Oh, here it goes. There, there was one, and here's the other one. All right, so now I just take a little lint free wipe and I dab them dry, and then I have a um, silicone tool, and I'm just going to pick it up with the silicone tool and place it on my nail, and then just push it into the tacky layer of the nail polish. Same thing with this one. Can't get any quicker or easier than that. So now I'm just going to take some of um, Jelly's Fairy Dust, which is my favorite holographic glitter topper. And I'm just going to put that around the image.
This brush is quite big. What I could do is just get a littler brush. I could do that. Hold on. Okay, so here is a littler brush. So we'll just go around the image. There we go. So I'm just going to cure this for 30 seconds and then I'll come back and we'll do a top coat. And then I'm just going to seal these in with a top coat. And then I'm going to cure that for a minute. Okay, so here is the finished look, and this is what the polish looks like cold. So I'm going to go heat it up. We'll check it out and see what it, the warm state looks like. And here's what they look like when they're warm. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.